No! Oh, sweetheart! You are so well intentioned, but so child. Such a child. Sexy bitches are my favorite kind of bitches. Hey everyone, Grave Cinema here, bringing you another reaction review video. This one is a patron subscriber pick by Chaos, and the movie we will be doing will be... Laid to Rest. Yes, Laid to Rest. I know nothing about this. I know fuck all about this as well. So, that's what, going we, into it cold. that's what we get with some of our subscribers. They'll recommend movies that I have never even heard of before in my life. And they're pretty good at it. Like, Full Moon, no offense, is the best. But, Chaos, you've had some pretty good bangers, and so has Deep Thought. And Misdirection got us with a good one last night that neither of us had seen either. That is true. So let's see what clues we can get from this. Uh, a gory, wicked, merciless piece of horror cinema. Thank you, Ryan Rotten from ShockToYourDrop.com. So it's a slasher. Supposedly, yes. It is a slasher. If you want blood, you've got it. Uh, from New Morgue Magazine. And the most inventive death scenes in years all from BloodyDisgusting.com. Isn't that I nice? I'm so glad I didn't eat first. I know. A Long Night's Journey into Hell from Fangoria. So, it looks like it'll be fun. Uh, what year was this? 2009 I'm seeing here. Um, so roughly around that time. Uh, these sometimes aren't accurate, but... That's about what we're looking at here. So, it's going to be some type of slasher film from the late 2000 aughts. Alright. Okay. Alright. Alright, well, let's get to watching this, because once we see it, we can then talk about it and give our review, see what we thought about it. Alright? Yeah. Are you ready? Do it. Alright. Lay to rest. Oh, I'm going to hate this. What makes you say that? The title sequence. Obviously, since that's what we're watching. What do you think is going to happen? Serial killer. Tortures his victims. Here's so. Lots of begging for their lives. I really hate begging for their lives. Oh, Lena Hetty's in this. Okay. She's a good actress. Definitely serial killer likes women. Yeah, but women are easier prey. Depends oh. on the woman. And they got titties. Damn, titties in the opening credit sequence. That's one way to open up your film. Literally. And a casket? Yep. Oh, it's not like she's buried yet. Yet. She's locked in there, though. Hey! She got herself out. Final girl or first victim? What do you think? Hmm. We're gonna have victims. Go to the window, baby. I'll say verse victim. Don't go in there. Why did she go in there? Maybe they have a phone she can use. Castles don't have phones, asshole. Maybe they do morgues. Phone! See? Mm, that's not gonna work. I hear a tone. You had to look up an emergency for 911? Wow, that's special. I don't know. Trace the fucking call, you dumb bitch. See, run a trace. I mean, just say you're in a morgue. You're gonna pull off the goddamn thing, aren't you? What a dumb bitch. Also, why are you doing that? Why are you doing that? She's probably been drugged. Hello. Are you from the police? Yes. He's from the police. The man police in the mask. Police wear scary masks like that all the time. Of course they do. Find a window. I think she's been drugged. Get down. What? He's there. He's there. Huh? And now he has keys. She got up though. 
She did. That was rather quick. Just stay until the baby away on white. Laid to rest. You run out of gas? So you got a name? Probably. My name's Tucker. You ain't from around these parts, are you? Where'd you come from? Where the dead people are. Some place I can drop you off. Why are you not there? thinking to take her to straight to the police? Oh, please say this. Are you out of your mind? We don't even know her. She's probably one of them crystal meth. There's my Hetty. It wouldn't surprise me if she was a prostitute. And another man tried to hurt me. I woke up in a box also. I don't know if he told you that. But for all I know, I'm already dead. In the morning, we'll take you to the sheriff's. You're safe here. I even cook you breakfast. You're safe here. She's safe there. Foolish mortals. His truck went by the mortuary. <laughs> wrong with her head. <laughs> Everything's gonna be fun, I promise you. It's all gonna be okay. We got at least a concussion. Fucking window open. Of course, it's a horror movie. We leave the windows open in those. It's Gabriel. Malignant. Oh. Hey, Cindy. Cindy, come on, I'll lock myself out. Cindy? Oh, oh it's... Right. It really hurts. Can't kill her, she's the most Why well-known actress in this movie. No, no! He's gonna kill her! He's gonna kill her! Tell me, you fuck! That's as gory as Game of Thrones, at least. Yeah, and that's why you don't leave windows open, huh? Yeah. I have said it before, I will say it a thousand times again. I don't care if there's a screen. Don't leave a fucking window open. It's modern day. What the fuck was that? Something got stabbed with. That looks like he's got a partner. Why are we out here, Johnny? You think he's cheating on Cindy? Oh, that's like a shit. Well, they're about to die. I saw what I saw. Now I gotta go in there. Whose car is that? Huh? Huh, Skull? You left your keys in the vehicle, dipshit. I'm dying to know who this bitch is. Yeah, you are. Baby, you never cheat on me now, would you? I would never cheat on you. And I never have. Oh! Well. Getting good use out of that knife. Ooh, just took off the whole front part of the head. We are getting some good gore here. Get in the front seat. Drive. That is where the bad guy is. Thought he had a good slice on her, so that's a really sharp blade. Well, if you were a dramatic serial killer, wouldn't you keep your stuff edged to it? Mm-hmm. I mean, come on now. It's not amateur hour. I know this is the worst thing. Thank you, Tails. It's kind of late, isn't it? Hey, fat guy. Oh, yeah. I don't have a traditional landline per se. I have a computer. Thank goodness, the sheriff. Yeah, I can send an email. Tell them to send all the cops. All the cops. Uh, what for? And he wants to. He had a shiny face, and he. And he wants to make me dead. Fantastic. Great. Okay. It's like she's forgotten some vocabulary. Head injuries will do that. Actually, it might just take a minute. That's an old piece of shit. When was this movie made? Two thousand nine. But even okay. still. Maybe they it's must, a poor town, man. They gotta be way out in the middle of nowhere. Of course, always convenient for a horror movie. Mm -hmm. Do you have evidence of insurance fraud? Do you suspect or know? We a have a murder. Or terrorist or criminal? Help! Send many cops. Send many cops. 
You can find out about people on this thing. It's called the internet. Let's see. Nothing on the Americas most wanted. Probably an affluent citizen like a doctor or a surgeon. Boring rich white guy. If they found them, how do they know they're dead? He videotaped all the girls' murders and sent them to the police. I knew it was coming. It's just in her head. I know, but still. Yeah. Why are you hiding who she is? We all go at the sheriff's station. It'll be too late by the time city police get here. No way. I'm not getting murdered tonight, thanks. Trust me. You don't want this guy to come knocking with you here alone. I understand. We're at a police station. Why are we getting weapons? Tire stick. Oh, Tire stick. Tire stick. Maybe we can jam it in his ears. Jam it in his eyes. Well, they already did. You should turn around and leave now. And keep driving. Sheriff, are you there? It's Tucker Smith. But he killed my deputy. I'm locked in the supply closet. Well. Huh. Alright then. Dead. Camera. The sheriff. I hit him with my car. But he killed my deputy. It's a recording. It is. That was the same thing. Yeah, it's because he's dead. What do you think you're doing, hero? Did she stab him or did he get stabbed? She stabbed him. Oh Quick cuts makes it hard to tell when he gets stabbed. I think we should go back to his house. Wait for the city cops to go. She's right. She's right. Stop! That's where I'm from. I have to remember something. No, you don't. Tell her who she is. You have the thing in your pocket. Y'all are dumb. My mom's in there. My mom's in there. Her funeral's tomorrow. Why don't you just show her what's in your pocket? Well, he's dying. He's playing the video. Who's there? He said, he said who's, who's there. there. He's dead. I mean, nobody else is gonna die here tonight. Yeah, nobody. Except your driver. I'm not dead! You are too dead! You leave me alone! You're dead. You have to know he's in there. <laughs> You're dead. <laughs> hey. Why are we hanging out? Why are we sitting around? Just chilling. Maybe I should have stayed dead. When you wasn't dead. I guess I'm still kind of confused. Snap out of. She has a head injury, man. She probably can't. I didn't even see her. Got us done. Interesting. He sticks it on his face. Bridget! Bridget! Over here! Hey! 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 Now what are you gonna do? No! Yes, just crying. beat the door. Got a literal pry bar. You've got a pry bar. Use it like a pry bar. Why did you throw your fucking weapon? You I'm sorry, I'll get us out. Some dumb decisions here. Goes her head. Oh, 
again. Not killing her, though. But no, he has to play with his cheap food before he eats it. Come on. He's shown that. He likes the torture. It's cutting off the heads and putting it with different bodies so that they're harder to find. Battery's dead. Just keep her safe! Don't blame me! You're the one who yelled at her and left! Just the ass. Yeah, just the ass, that's all. Oh, yeah, she's, she's, alive. Alive. she's alive. You were trusting the wrong person to reload that. You wrong person. Wrong person. Evidently. Grab it quick! Genius. Hey. Guys! Out of here. He's about to die. Nope. Wow. Oh, then the guy's already in the car. Sugar! I should still call It needs some sort of a password to make a call. Now and one should still work. No, Why aren't you driving? No, um, because we can't have them make smart decisions in this movie, otherwise we wouldn't have a movie. Yeah, I guess so. But they are being really dumb. Royally dumb. Oh, we got him all right. How he's not dead. Hey, look, pop the trunk. Let me see if there's anything else we can use. Maybe another cell phone. His mom's gonna be in the trunk. Nope. It's wife. And his mom. This shit ain't part of the deal. You got it? Not at all. <laughs> I ain't never had one of them. You're supposed to keep that shit up there. Yeah, she's gonna leave him. That mean he can see where she's headed. Mm -hmm. Last ride. Break the window. Sexy bitches on my favorite kind of bitches. Help! Hey! Here! Sexy bitches on my favorite kind of bitches! Very helpful. That's right, now I got the mask. Dude! Anything. Killers like that are obsessed with their mass. Keep fighting. That's right. Take out Here's the eye. Uh... You're not. Okay. Okay, I'll do it. Many people are dead tonight. You do you. Don't let everyone dead. Hmm. So what does this guy want? Friend, we have a lovely little ID. That ain't it. Sunday, no alcohol sales. But so you're telling me it's a dry county and you got booze for sale. It ain't dry. It's moist. It's moist. What the fuck is moist? It means we got rules. Okay. Tommy and I are getting ready to go to Hot Atlanta for an all-week rave. You wanna come with us? Um, Friends are meeting there. Uh, she she wants to come with us. Uh, it's been a hell of a night. Is there anything I can get for you? Little videotapes. Well, is it gonna be a good movie? No. So child, such a child. No, 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 sweetheart. 
Get him. We gotta go now. No, 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 no. Just no, no. Tell me what's going on. What do you think you're doing, huh? Anthony. He's like, I guess I gotta deal with you. You think you're going in there to get her? Is that what you think? Baby, if you're gonna shoot, shoot. If he's coming at you with a knife, shoot him right now. Should have shot him. He's just a kid. I don't know. He is so valiant. <gasps> hey, where are you going? Check in to see if that's the only way in, man. It's not, and you're already dead. Oh, there he goes. I'm sorry, I'm sorry about the car. It's all right, it's okay. Your friend's dead. You should get out of there. Anthony's gone. It's just a lot of blood. Yeah, he's dead. We gotta find anything we can to hurt this fucker. Yeah, I can't find anything. All I got is this tire ceiling. Bunch of ammo, none for his gun. He ain't got no 45s. <laughs> you got alcohol. Fire works for just about anything. Yeah, Molotov is ass. Just as hey, ace. This is cyanacrylate. Is it good? The Tastes great. Of all glues. Made himself a bomb, did he? Okay, kid. Death. I've never seen tire sealant in the ear before. Mm hmm. Well, when there's been so many horror movies and so many deaths, I've got to think to get creative to do something that's never been done before. Maybe if you could aim straight, he'd be dead already. Somebody great. What did you think that was going to do, sweetie? I don't want Tucker to die. Yeah, he's been a good guy so far. He's gonna die because he can't take that guy with his injury. Go, man. Swedish. You didn't tell me you were making a movie. That's gonna cost you a little bit extra. <sighs> Hit with the bat in the back of the head. The same bat that's in that store. <gasps> Maybe they could only afford the one prop. <laughs> I give up! I don't care anymore! Come and get me! Nice, nice, nice. Well, that's the way you get him. Uh oh, she's seeing his face now. He's gonna use the adhesive that the dude jacked up. Yeah. You're right. Peel some skin off, are we? It peels whole face off. How 
is he still alive? It's a mimi. Nice and gooey though. Good practical effect work. He's not dead yet, baby girl. He will be if she grabs his knife and stabby stabbies. Yeah. There's that. I mean... Stab him anyway. He won't be able to see her. His hand's gonna move. He's gonna grab her. She got the baseball bat. She's gonna smash the skull. There you go. I think he's dead now. I hope so. He's breathing! But is that him breathing or is that the actor? Not being able to hold still. <sighs> he's moving! He's not dead! <laughs> See? Look! I love you more than anything. Okay, maybe now he's dead. Well, he lived. Surprisingly. It's a movie where you feel like she'd be the only one at the end there. We both thought she'd be the first victim. Well, was one of the other first victim or final girl. Yeah. Shouldn't we wait for the cops to come? I've waited. Where are we going? Atlanta. Atlanta. It's nice. I think so. Yeah. Sounds perfect. Bye, sucker. Where were you when we needed you, huh? Uselessly not showing up. And credits. Mm -hmm. Oh, more stuff in the credits. He's very Stephen with his mom. It's nice that they actually showed us the note, though. Mm hmm. All right, so that was Laid to Rest. A patron pick by our Patreon subscriber, Chaos. Mm -hmm. And what are our thoughts on this one? Uh, interesting choice of name for the movie. Probably because of all the coffins and such. Maybe. And they, maybe that's part of the MO, because we never got anything involving a reason as to why they were doing what they were doing. My money's on the fact that she was a prostitute. I could see that. There's been more than one serial killer that's targeted prostitutes. I mean, we had... I was getting Jack the Ripper vibes myself when they mentioned Caucasian, affluent, probably a doctor and such, and those are things that were known to be um, as a possibility as to what Jack the Ripper could be, at least in one of the movies I've, saw, I've seen before. So, and going after a prostitute, yeah, very much a serial killer in the vein of Jack the Ripper here, uh, from what we can tell. Yeah. Um, I've also seen them before where, uh, their mom was a prostitute or something like that. Something that happened in their childhood with a prostitute that caused trauma, made them hate them forever. Um, that was a SVU thing. Okay. Because there were sex crimes involved too in the way he's cutting up the bodies and putting them with different bodies to hide his tracks. And making sure they're all naked. It's very perverted. Mm-hmm. Doesn't seem like he fucks them though, so there's that at least. Yeah. He's... Why does he calls them... Though. Uh, to demean them. I think you're I think right. So. He thinks they're lesser because of what they are. Just interesting that he chose piggies. You know? Mm hmm. I mean, yeah. there, there are other derogatory terms he could have used. Well, that's just what they used here. So. Um. Uh, they're not like any type of uh, slasher killer that has a mask. They're obsessed with the mask. If you knock it off, nope, gotta put it back on. You can't. Can't, can't keep have killing your without it. See your face. No, no. No. I also like that we never saw his face. Yeah, that's good. It's intriguing. It's not something they did before. I mean, and we saw it after it was melted off. I mean, that doesn't count as a skull. It yeah. looks like a human skull. Anyway, though, uh, it, the DVD case was right. There are really interesting kills, things you don't normally see, like tire sealant and. Yeah. I mean, um, it's not a movie with a very high budget, which is evident, but it's a movie that does try to be at least creative with what it can it do. It definitely succeeds in creativity. Like, it's like, well, we have all these options. And how, you know, it, it, 
it was interesting how the guy somehow knew that was the other guy's mom to use against him in the hearse. How he used Stephen's mom to fuck yeah. with him. Mm -hmm. And then played the thing. It was interesting with how he played with him, even though that wasn't his target. Well, he was there. He was interfering. I guess so. But he didn't go after him when he was standing outside the barn with all of his victims in it while he was torturing poor whatever her fucking name is. Uh, even though he had... Princess? Yeah, even though he had the guy yeah. outside up and moving around and capable of fucking things up for him. Mm -hmm. He stayed very focused. It's unique. He was quite focused on his goals. And of course, he's got that, you know, slasher killer uh, trait of, well, you can't shoot straight or hit him or actually kill them until oh, the very, very end. Oh, he definitely hit him, yeah. But... Because he was hit, but at then again, at the end, you're like, oh, point blank. Oh, you miss? Really? You miss? I know. Because this was... Well, good. I think the problem yeah. was is that he aimed for his head. Maybe. A lot of people think if you go for the head, it's better. But really, you should go for the heart. Yeah, go for the chest. It's bigger. Yeah. Better chance of pinning it. But also, it's a movie where clearly they needed the characters to do dumb things in order for the movie to still movie. We gotta go back. We can't let our brother see her like that. Yeah. We're just going to stop for a minute for no apparent reason at this guy's house again. Yep, and of course that's to isolate them with uh, no phones working. Out I had just nowhere. fucking left. Yeah, just drive. Just keep going. Gotten, if, if his car had enough gas, I would have just gotten it and gone. Go to you, hit highway, speed like hell till you find a road cop. They'll pull you over. You can be like, the situation is this. Yeah. But it has to try to isolate them, so it's, you know, one of In those things nowhere, where there's no town, help coming. Where nobody apparently yeah. has any gas ever. No and gas, no signal. Or it's a locked phone. Or they don't have cell phones and you don't have a landline because it got cut off because you're poor as shit. Uh, yeah, some movies are smart with the way they do it. Other ones are just like, eh, we don't have the budget, just do whatever. <laughs> and it's, it shows in this one, but still it does have some creativity involved, as mm -hmm. we've mentioned already, so. Yeah, it was unique. And it's a serial killer, which is fascinating, even if it's terrifying, because, oh my god. Guy seemed like a robot. Yeah. Just gonna keep going and going like the Energizer Bunny. And which very in sync with what certain slashers can be. Like a Michael Myers or like a Jason. Like Very just, Michael Myers. Like, I will not yeah. add Jason into that just because he seems more supernatural. Well, just in that essence, but I mean just in the robotic nature, like your focus. But like, definitely I will like kill Michael you. Myers and he's he's got a goal. Yeah. The only thing is, is with those guys is they'll kill anybody. Anybody that's around. Yeah, if well, they that, hear a living, breathing them. human being, yeah. they're going to go for him. This guy was like, are you directly interfering with me right now? No? Okay. I don't care. Um, and then goes for the girl again. Mm hmm But yeah. Clever thinking on the Steven guy's part uh, to mix that shit up into the medical adhesive. Because, I mean, even if he didn't use it to put in his mask, could have thrown it at him. Could have done something. Yeah. Yeah. And he, I think, you're right, he had probably the most interesting kill with the uh, tire spray in there and then just... Yeah, although it, it is unique how both siblings got their faces cut off. There is a lot of faces coming off in this movie. Um, the way the gut cut looked on the sibling, the brother's... Brother-in-law's uh, lady? Girl, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, that was actually fairly well done. It looks way better than I've seen in a lot of other movies where their guts are coming right out of their belly. Mm-hmm. You know? It wasn't too bad. Um... Yeah, he had quite a few faces coming off in this one, <laughs> honestly. Yeah. Part of me just wants to see his backstory. Like, who is he? Yes, you want the backstory. You Where did he come from? The info. What is he doing in that town? Besides buying off the mortician so he can use his barn for his dirty, disgusting deeds. Mm-hmm, yep. Also surprising that he tra didn't try and do anything about the smell. Like, you'd have thought he'd lay some lye or something to help cut down on the smell of the dead just bodies. Just a little spray. Tss anything some fresh space dry weed up there so gotta be a lot of things that cover <laughs> that scent have some shit laying around it would have mixed yeah um he seems like a pretty careful killer to have not thought of that but 
Yeah. I like that the sheriff was ready to go in anyway, whether or not, you know, like, I, it makes you wonder if he would have gone for the sheriff's department that night anyway. Yeah, that is true. Also, this killer is one that has to videotape Everything. what he does. Like, if, if, it's, if the tape's not rolling, it's not happening. Right. Okay? Right. Um, and I bet you that he kept copies of all of them somewhere. Yep, well, we gotta look back on all your fun, you know, trophies and conquests. Every serial killer usually takes a trophy. So, it mm -hmm. fits. Yeah. So, a uh, fun killer, I would say. A un unique killer. Unique in the sense that we haven't seen this specific one before. Um, like, with the videotaping going after like certain elements he's a mixture of certain ones he, like, he also has his own unique weapon like the, the michael myers jack the ripper he has his knife he has actually has two knives but it's a very noticeable weapon so like well every killer's gotta have their own thing you know when it comes to weapons that, that was the one they gave you know simple effective mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. easy to replicate and sell yeah so uh not a bad killer i'll say mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. do you have any final thoughts on Laid to rest? Oh, you know me. I always want more backstory. But other than that... Always. Oh, yeah. And on the cover, they got the... The, uh, the knives. The knives. The blades. They probably had those I'm specially sure made. those knives, too. No, they've done things like that before. Just to say, this looks badass. Oh, Same yeah. at Ren Fairs before. Oh, this is badass, yes. Yeah. Protect your fingers while you're knife fighting, because you're a badass who knows how to knife fight. Well, you could punch with that. Like brass knucks, I guess, in a sense, too. So... Yeah, you could. So I wouldn't want anything my fingers could get trapped in, but yeah, I get the the logistics of it. Mhm. Mm so, final thoughts? My final thoughts are: I wish they'd put more backstory, but all in all, it was good. I was glad to see that our first victim ended up being our final girl. Supposedly first victim, like that's always the thing. Okay, is this gonna be just an opening kill and then we meet our protagonist, or is this person gonna be with us throughout the whole thing? And it turns out she was with us throughout the whole thing. It takes so. place all in one night, just like Christmas. Just like Christmas. <laughs> all right, so thank you very much, Chaos, for this uh, pick from our Patreon subscriber there. Uh, please let us know your thoughts on this as well in the comments here. Same if you have any trivia. We always like trivia. Yeah, if you like just all, just give us a like and subscribe and you'll be able to see our next video on YouTube when that comes out. YouTube will tell you. And if you want to see more things or see them before YouTube tells you, we also have this lovely Patreon. And as I um, mentioned, yes, we do have that where you can see them up sooner if you subscribe to a certain sooner. tier. Mm -hmm. That is true. Your so, votes also count for more on that Patreon. Yeah, if you give so. us money, we'll, we'll tend to do things for you. Like watch what you want us to watch. But only at a certain tier. Other times, you give us money, you'll get more of a say in our polls. Yeah. There's levels. Yeah. We like options. Yeah. It's so. A thing. Yeah. So anyway. thank you if you do yes, that. Yes, please. You're and awesome. Thank you. If not, and if you don't whatever. do that, even if you're just watching this video, we still appreciate you because yeah. views are good. Yeah. Thanks. We just like to know that there's a reason why we do this because people still watch. Besides his amusement. Oh, that too. It's always funny to see your reactions from my own <laughs> self. So. Um, but yeah, so thank you for watching this video, and we hope to have you for the next one. Alright? Until then. Stay spooky. Bye.